Uh, some people in your party calling for a special session to take up these transportation issues. One of these roads is in your district. Absolutely. Is that what we need? Special session? We do. I think, you know, the governor had that task force a few years ago. I've met with Secretary Gottlieb. He had really good ideas about what we can do to help transportation. I'm very worried about my district and the Verona Road area, but also in our towns. We're not giving them funding either. So they're talking about laying gravel over the existing crumbling roads because they can't keep up with all the stuff they need to do as well with maintenance. So, so do we have to raise taxes? I mean, we have to come up with money to do that. How do Absolutely. we do it? Absolutely. I think we've got to have that conversation. My door is open. I'm looking forward to what the Republicans have to say. What is their solution? We had a chance to do it in the budget by taking this uh, federal dollars for Medicaid money. They decided not to do that. What is their proposal? We need to move forward because we have to keep people safe in the state of Wisconsin. Representative, uh, some of these projects are, are not too far away from you. The uh, Highway 10, uh, 441 project is close by. What do you say to the people who say we need to get back into session, take another look at transportation? Sure. Well, I'm a little confused because taking federal dollars for Medicaid expansion would not fix one single road in the state. I mean, so let's let's be clear on that. Um, but we do have to look over the course of the next few, two years and try to come together over a solution to broaden the base of funding for transportation. The first thing our responsibility is to make sure that every dollar that's being spent in transportation is being spent wisely. Uh, I think we're getting to that point, so now we have to look at the revenue I'll side. Give you a final, we need action and we need it now. The state of Wisconsin needs roads that they can travel to and be safe going to and from work. All right. Representative Diane Hesselbein is from Middleton. Representative Jim Steinke is the Assembly Majority Leader from Kokana. Thanks very much to both of you for being with us Thank today. You. You Thank you.